Welcome to the A-Level Music Tech Tour. This tour is just going to demonstrate how to use the resources that we provide for the A-Level Music Technology course. So let's just get started. From the off, how to navigate your way around. So we provide lots and lots of resources every single year. Um, and sometimes it can get a bit cluttered and a bit clumsy and it's hard for students and teachers to find their way around. So we've rethought the way that we're going to deliver that. So let's start. So here we have the A-Level Music Tech link. So when you click on this, it will take you to this page. From the top area, you have the most relevant information for getting started. So if you're completely new to the A-Level Music Tech course, you've got this A-Level overview, and it just demonstrates the specification for the course. The next bit is you have the AS coursework area and the AS exam area. These are relevant for the first year of study. So if you're an AS student, you come to the coursework and you'll be, de you'll be delivered with this particular image here where it says, okay, you've got free tasks and logbook to complete. And each resource will guide you through, through each of those in a very logical way. Okay, so you can start there. When it gets time to studying for your exam, we have an exam error. This is made up of 12 different studies and hopefully it will cover everything that you need to be successful in your exam. Remember though with the exam error, you do need to start early. A lot of people leave it to the last couple of months, but there's a lot to cover. So make sure you do start early, take on a stu study at a time. Next area then we've got the A2 coursework area and the A2 exam area and it's the same again if you're an A2 student this is where you want to come to first and this will guide you through all of the resources in a very logical way. On this last bit we have the teachers area so if you're a teacher and you're new to the course or you've been doing it a while we provide schemes of works, some lesson plans, we're going to make that even bigger this year. We also provide some reporting tools as well. We're currently working on them, but hopefully by September they will be ready and they'll help you report back to your students and keep a progress journal. So let's go down to the nitty gritty if you were. We, we do courses, we do like, I think it's about eight or nine courses every year, or at least last year was. And this is how you could navigate to them. If you don't want to go to the coursework area, you can come to the specific courses. And you can see we've got lots and lots of these. So say for instance, you're looking at task 1A. You can go, okay, let's go to the coursework and let's navigate to the relevant course. So you can say, okay, where's my task 1A? And here we are, we have last year's course, or sorry, two years ago course, which is um, task 1A, la, la, la. As we develop more courses, they will be on the front page. So it should be easier for you to get to those courses. Here's last year's one here. If you want the exam resources, you can just come here and we've got all of the exam resources. And once again, we'll be creating this year's styles, which is rock and roll and hip hop and rap. And we have worksheets for A2 and we have listening exam papers for AS and lots and lots of good stuff there. Also, if you're an A2 student, you scroll to the bottom. We also have this history and development of music tech. And in there, there's close to 40 questions to help you with question. Um, the essay question, which is question four of the exam at A2. Really good stuff. As you come down then, you've got this getting re get revising area, and this just goes into all the different things. So we've got a styles page, where you'll get stylistic fingerprints, you'll get all of the courses from all the different styles, and you'll get some other stuff as we work through, like practice papers and things like that. You've got our revision cards, our quizzes. These are not all the quizzes at the moment. We also have lots more quizzes built into the styles themselves. So to get the full depth of our quizzes and, and our revision cards, you do have to go to the, the the styles questions as well, but we have loads and loads here to get you started. And we're looking at doing mind maps, so this should help with your revision. We've got a lovely comprehensive question bank, and then finally a glossary. Scrolling down then, we also have a skills area. So if you're not familiar with, say, the software that you're gonna be using, like Logic Pro, you can go here and you can go to the Logic Pro area and you can learn lots of new different skills. Or if you want to, take on say learning how to use a microphone or learning how to record something or mix something that's where you you will head off to you'll head off to the skills area and um, we also got a community area so you can ask questions and you can look at previous questions to help you through coursework and exams and we have the teachers area as I said previously and then finally we have this area which is the 2017 spec currently we're not there yet so we're still working off of off of the old spec but um next year this will become very very relevant on the left hand side we have all of the general knowledge and information that you're going to need throughout the year so currently we're in the summer so we look at the summer tasks when we get to august we start looking at the grade boundaries revision 
courses um, lots and lots of really good stuff there and the listening list for next year's styles which are rock and roll and hip-hop so I hope that has given you a nice round overview of what we do for the A a level in music technology have a look through it click on some of the links and see how you get on if you've got any questions please don't hesitate to contact us or view the community area